Over in Australia, it's we only have you know very few boys that have actually got Bath syndrome. Um, Western Australia, where I come from, I've only, I've got the only two that we know of. We were just sort of flying blind, as you would say, because yeah, we knew nothing nothing about it. So we it's just sort of comforting to know that there is extra help out there or guidance or someone's opinion or something like that. Just yeah, makes it a lot easier. Yeah. It's definitely sort of opened my eyes up to to um, all the friendliness and everything and how everybody just, you know, accepts you and, and uh, treats you as if they've known you for years, even though they've only known you by a name and whose child you belong to and that sort of thing. So, yeah. The, the, the support there for parents um, is, yeah, it's just comforting, really. Um, just to know, as I said, especially with the ones that have got older children, just, um, you know, you, you'd go on there and someone's just come back from a medical appointment and they're going fine and everything's going great and then someone else had come back from a medical appointment and the child's been admitted and you sort of, you, you go through it with them because you know all the hospital appointments and all the medical appointments and sitting in waiting rooms and things like that and yeah it's just comforting to know that people are out there doing exactly the same thing for the same reason as as you. There is going to be a future for them um, through knowing that there's future for others as well. Yeah, definitely.